That's right! Woo! When it comes to actors who have evolved from the WWE, Dave Bautista, better than The Rock. Dave Bautista kills it in everything I've seen him in. Even if it's a bad movie, he's the best part of that movie. I haven't seen a performance from The Rock where he was a legitimate character besides The Rock since uh, Faster, and Faster was made in 2010. For example, in Fast Five, The Rock played this badass Texan cop. He had a Texas accent. Over the last three movies, where did that accent go? The Rock only plays The Rock. Dave Bautista is so much better. The plot. The year is 2028. The city is Los Angeles. The Hotel Artemis is a cheap ripoff from John Wick's Continental Hotel. It's a hotel for criminals, and it seems to only have two employees. The basis of this movie is that there's a huge riot going on in LA, and circumstances bring a bunch of criminals that don't get along into the hotel. Jodie Foster is a nurse at this hotel, and she's having a very busy night. And shit gets meh. Jodie Foster! She's been a nurse in this hotel for like 20-something years. She's also in charge of this hotel as well as maintaining the rules. This is basically her movie. Her character had the most backstory. She also does the best job at acting in this movie. You can tell Jodie Foster loves this character, and it really comes through her performance. Great job. Dave Batista. He is the other employee at the hotel. His job is to enforce the rules. And he was my favorite character. His job is really to beat the fuck out of anyone that breaks the rules. But he's polite and he's sensitive and he's just over it when it comes to people giving him attitude. His character is also very funny. He's great at comedy. I loved him. I love Dave Bautista. Better than The Rock. Sterling K. Brown. He's kind of the main character in this movie. The movie at least starts out with his character and brings you to the hotel. And the way you learn about this hotel is through his situation. Another great performance from Sterling K. Brown. It's really nice to see Randall from This Is Us not being such a bitch. Yeah, I don't like Randall. He's kind of a bitch and his work situation really pisses me off. He's better in Hotel Artemis than he is in This Is Us, okay? I just want to give another shout out to this huge cast in this movie. It's full of awesome people. You got Sofia Botella, you got Charlie Day, you got Jeff Goldblum. Great cast. Overall! This movie's just okay. The acting and the actors are very good in this movie, but some actors don't understand how cheesy they should be. And with some of these actors going over the top and some of these actors playing it serious, the tone is way off. I thought the hotel was a cool idea. It's from John Wick, but it's a cool idea. There's way less action than I expected. There's just not enough. We need more. The writing is where this movie really suffers. It just doesn't go anywhere. I also wasn't a fan of the ending. When you have these great actors doing these crazy characters and interacting with each other, it's really enjoyable. But it's just not enough for me to recommend for you to see the movie. You can skip this one, wait till it's on TBS. Subscribe!